Royal House shares update on King's health. His Majesty's general condition is said to be satisfactory. King Harold V of Norway's health is steadily improving. On Wednesday, the Norwegian Royal House said that the 87-year-old monarch's general condition is satisfactory and that the treating physicians are content with the progress. In the latest update, the Royal House also revealed that the King's infection is under control and that his pacemaker insertion is likely to take place early next week. It had previously been announced that His Majesty required a permanent pacemaker, but the timing of the implantation would be determined when he is completely free from infection. The King of Norway was hospitalized with an infection late last month during his holiday in Malaysia. IT was announced on March 2 that due to a low heart rate, His Majesty had a temporary pacemaker implanted at Hospital Sultana Maliha in Langkawi. According to the King's personal physician, Bjorn Benz, the procedure was to make the King's return back home safer. His Majesty was medically transported home to Norway on March 3. Upon his arrival, he was admitted to the hospital Rikshospitalet. Days later on March 6, King Harold and his wife Queen Sonia released a joint message expressing their gratitude. We feel a great need to thank you for all the care, help and support in connection with the king falling ill on our holiday in Malaysia, the royal couple said, translated to English. We have felt the warmth flowing from the Norwegian people during this time. The great commitment has moved us and strengthened us. Many thanks to everyone for the care you have shown us in the family. Once back at home in Norway, we would also like to extend a big thank you to the Malaysian authorities and staff at the Sultana Maliha Hospital in Langkawi. Together with Norwegian health personnel, they did everything they could to ensure that the king would recover well from his illness and be ready for the journey home, they added. We are very grateful to the Norwegian government, the armed forces and others who assisted in making the journey home so safe and smooth for us. At Rikshospitalet, the king is now undergoing expert treatment. We thank everyone who has given us care, practical and health-related help in a challenging situation.